Digital Punk and uh, 29 years old, also known as René de Bruy. Yeah, I make Hardstyle and at least it's my project, uh, it's a monthly podcast. It expands to even uh, events like Mega Base Outdoor. Well, in, in the beginning, uh, I really had to, you know, explain to my fellow colleagues that this was something that we could build together, and you know that it was also good for them to put their music, their new tracks, uh, in 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 unleashed. We could do so much more, you know, with just a podcast. We could make it like a platform for everybody, for my colleagues to drop their new tracks for myself to drop the new tracks. We really have the newest and, you know, the finest hard style of the moment captured in a monthly podcast. And from there we could build like merchandise, uh, events and stuff. So I had the idea already for a long time. The very first one was an instant hit. So then we knew we, uh, we did well and we had a very long way to go with uh, lots of success, I think. Everybody that you know, wants to have their track in Unleashed and if it's a quality track can drop it. It's a really short way to get your track really known to the people. If I see my own tracks, for example, before I drop it in Unleashed and test it on the dance floors, nobody really knows the tracks. But when I put it in Unleashed, everybody screams the tracks, you know, after they heard it in Unleashed. If you like Hardstyle, I think you like Unleashed. What my intention is with Unleashed is to bring the new and fresh music to people, but also to create something that people from over, all over the world can listen to Hardstyle and can experience the new feeling, you know? Because Unleashed is a feeling, um, not only as a podcast, but as a whole genre and a whole brand. I think Unleashed is fresh and it's given to the people as in a fresh way. Also with the takeovers, the special things. Sometimes I produce an, an intro or an outro or something special for the show that costs me like two days or something. And uh, I think not a lot of shows do, uh, do that. go from indoor to an outdoor event and to do mega base outdoor unleashed yeah, it was something really special and also a bit scary actually you don't know how many people will visit and in collaboration with the high energy event we had a very massive big stage and we had a big big party and it was all a really good time everything was perfect not a lot of parties go that well with everything the chemistry the, the weather was perfect the fireworks music <laughs> to play six hours on my own event was something really special because when I started I remembered that uh, the song broke through exactly at the moment that my intro was done yeah that was a really special moment um, as well as I thought that, that I was going to be very tired in two or three hours. But yeah, I was so full of adrenaline that I didn't take one break. And uh, the feeling was yeah something that I can't describe. It's my own brand uh, at my own event. And uh, yeah, to invite people that I can work with on stage, that was really special because the chemistry was so good and also the chemistry with, uh, with the crowd was insane and everybody that you know played there said to me that oh, you definitely have to do this again next year because this was really something really cool and still people talk about it Unleashed Soldiers if you want to re-experience the Unleashed feeling 
of Unleashed Outdoor. Go to megabase.nl and buy your tickets now and I'll see you all there.